<laughs> he got he got the upset with the the two one victory in winners quarter. So gonna be seeing a matchup that a happens pretty, rather a often. A pretty common matchup yeah. at ignition. Any other ignition, this could have happened. So not the, we didn't get Ned versus uh, I can like plan. We got a couple of upsets to get to this spot. So yeah, I, I can fell early to uh, ice knife. Oh wait, 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 wait. this is both. It, it, this could have been Ike and Ned, and then said it is Ice Knight Raven King. Oh baby, here we go on small battlefield. Uh, neither player has a game advantage. I have to tell Jacob right now. He has to correct that. It is Ice Knight Raven King, zero zero, and they are they are playing it slow and steady at, at the outset of this uh, first. 20 seconds of small battlefield. And if you're if you're Greninja, this is not the game you want to be playing against Joker. Joker loves to play that mid-range game with the side Bs, the bullets, just to keep you out. Greninja is trying to get in there and get that damage. So the longer he's out, the more damage he's going to be tacking on. And Raven King already got him at kill percent. How low can you go oh. this early? You can go so low that you can't get the grapple recovery. Raven King had such a lead that he felt comfortable going that low for those back airs. He went for like two or three back airs off the right side of the stage, and it's gonna cost him. Yeah, the rare moment where Raven King edge guards, like something he's really known for, he got reversal on a very low percent. So like, he has play all the time, so I'm sure he's used to those kind of interactions. Oh no! <laughs> all the drag down up airs. Ice Knight dragged down four times, I think in that left platform situation, and it led to an incredible lead for Ice Knight here and in game number one. Not missing a beat on that respawn. It already has our son out from the beatings that Raven King took. Can he make the most of this Arsene? He's only gonna have about one more after this in this game. And even these side bees, they're, they're gonna burn a lot of Arsene meter. Like, you get 20%, but like how much Arsene meter is that really worth? Yeah, and throwing out that forward tilt, that, that's going to bring an end to our sense. Why didn't Raven King come in the back there? He has to come up with something better. Okay, yep, you're teching away. He, he's going to have to go for one of those edge guards here. Like, as, as much as it's discouraging to lose a stock early like that, how else are you going to bring this game back? Like, if you, if you cannot get Ice Knight off stage early. And Ice Knight is so patient with those back airs at the ledge trap situation. He, he's, he's not overcoming off the side. He's just waiting to cover the platform. He's waiting to cover the neutral getup. How are you gonna get this done? Okay, second Arsene brings us down to zero to 135. So, can he make the most of this? Already getting some damage, has him in the corner. Looking for those down airs, trying to get a little two piece forward smash. Hello? That was a zero to 16. <laughs> Okay. I throw it Arsene, Arsene's the back obviously there gone too. now, right? Yeah. And just like that, this game is, uh, is also very within reach for Raven King, but down tilt forward air will take it. That's one of those where if Ice Knight doesn't steal that game out, he's going to be kicking himself for at least the next game. So, putting that up. But, I, I mean, I it's can, Raven King, you got to feel pretty good about how that I game I cannot went. believe that we blinked and then all of a sudden it was a competitive game. We, we are talking about how Raven King is out of it, like how he... he his Arsene economy was not up to snuff to keep him in in the competitive game, right? And then all of a sudden, like, you, you keep one Arsene alive for just a, a smidgen of a second in any game, and then you're like, in trouble. But, okay. And, Ar and Joker just really compliments Raven King's play style very well. He's a very explosive player. Like, he will play that True. pace in neutral, but as soon as he gets the opening he wants, you could die, like at any percent. And Joker is the perfect character to do that and with. And Small Battlefield's a good stage to just find those openings, right? Like, the, there's there's no... Uh, you, you have some escape routes when you're at this ledge situation, but you can also take advantage of them if, if you're not too, like, like, confident in your recovery. So let, let's, let's see how this plays here. 36 to 36. And I, I think in particular, like, what makes this better than going to, like, a PS2 for Joker is just, like, once you get our Sen, Greninja can't just run away and press neutral B and just, like, mm. drain it with Water Shuriken. So it allows you to find that pressure from a safe distance and also be able to utilize those Arsens. So it totally makes sense to do the run back here and 
Starting off similar to game one, not getting that huge opening, but so far no early stocks taken. Arsene shows up early while going for the low recovery. Ooh. And what a great trade for Raven King. He finds the back air above the right platform here on small battlefield. And that is huge, but okay, that up smash is not gonna quite find the, the KO here. Good DI for Raven King on the back end. Yeah, but you can see Raven King definitely utilizing the data that he got in that first game. He got to stock right. that first game with that high recovery mascot disadvantage. And the, and the way Ice Knight's also covering those recovery options, he's typically covering low like that or like stage level. So and just playing around You know, he died off of, off of this, but I really like the Nair Guns attempt because the, there wasn't really much else that Raven King had in his back pocket to help him with the recovery. It was great coverage on, on the edge guard by Ice Knight. And just like that, Joker Arsene is about to come back in advantage state. You never want that when you're yep. in disadvantage to have you're, Joker. You're, you have immediately come back. go into disadvantage to Joker back throw, and you're like, I'm gonna. I could explode my right now. This, this is really bad. But wow, what good coverage with it. the A gun there, covering all of Small Battlefield. And you want to land on a platform? No, sir. More backers just exploding stocks for Raven King. And just continuing zero to pile to on this damage. And then zero to 60 in the RSN disappears. Brilliant stuff from Raven King as he covers every single option here on Small Battlefield. Yeah, just has all the momentum right now. Back throw will send him off stage. Potential edge guard situation. Continues to try to cover those roll wins to no avail so far. And But the pivot grab continued his coverage. So good stuff from Raven King. Look at him throwing away. Just keeps Ice Knight stunned in the corner. Oh, what I a have never seen anything like that. Knew that he wasn't going to be able to get the down tilt into up smash, so getting the full tech coverage with the side view was such a great play. That shadow sneak was so clutch for Ice Knight, but let's see if it's enough to get him back in this game. Yeah. Will we see another early gimp on the up B? Raven King definitely privy to that this time. The, those dash attacks into the corner, that, that seems like a little bit of a risk that Raven King's throwing out. Arsene comes out in the down <laughs> tilt. Oh. oh, I thought that was enough. That back air will absolutely be enough. enough. Every stock taken with Arsene back air that game. Yeah, if you're, uh, if you're Ice Knight, you, you're going to start thinking that the ground might be your best friend in this set. Maybe you're staying a little more grounded with that low profile of Greninja. Trying to fight your way out of the corner less, just trying to inch your way back into center yeah, stage. Yeah, find, find the right timing on those dash attacks. Find the right timing to just low pri profile what you can. And we are going to one game apiece here in winner semis of Ignition 300. And that situation too, where like Raven King was on the left side of the stage. He did not have stage control. So like, as Ice Knight, you want to focus on more so on draining that Arsene with some neutral bees and just like making him chase you. Like he's on the clock. So. That's where you do not guess. You do not commit unless you absolutely have to. You, you might be seeing a little bit of that right now here where Raven King, uh, in the opening of this game, he throws out a dash attack, and that dash attack gets whiffed. And I just might in the lead here a little bit. Missing out on the ledge trap, but Arsene is going to come out. This is when you want Arsene to come out, either when he's off, off stage or when you're in. Zero to 40. In an instant, you, you get a side B into forward tilt, and you're super happy about that when you're playing Joker. And you're starting to see that patience come out from Ice Knight too in the corner, which is something he desperately needs to hold on to these stocks. So, what a great B reverse Aegon though to get Raven King back on the stage. The and there's, there's that shadow sneak we saw in game number two. Nice. Hello? What a dip. Double dip the chip. Ice Knight, yeah. man. Ice I just really showing the limits of the tether recovery on Joker in this set. Like, if you can get the right angles, you can absolutely get those edge guards. But how low did <laughs> how low did Raven King go just there? Extremely. He went extremely low. That was like almost byless low on the tether recovery. But Ice Knight, the the problem is the persistence. As long as you are, understand the recovery angles that Joker needs to take and you time your fast fall off the stage at the perfect timing along with those angles, you are just in perfect position. 
just a normal Joker back here taking that stock. Uh, dead even. even. Despite that early lead, it felt like Ice Knight had got him. Things are just going back and forth with these percents. A low Big damage. Oh, that's a very early Arsene here for Raven King. Ooh. Which, with how well he's been using these Arsene so far in this set, you want that, because that evens the game right back up. And yet, how is Ice Knight trading so well with Arsene on this current even versus even stock position? It's been crazy and perfect shield timing on the platform here for Ice Knight. Yeah, we Man. call that a one to draw. Like, Ice Knight definitely lost his lead, but he didn't lose his stock when that Arsene came out, which is we're having a lot in this set. So that far. matters so much. Oh no! Speaking of what matters a ton is, is totally messing up the angle on your recovery. Yeah, that was one of those, like, you're going to be kicking yourself because it was, like, kind of an unforced error. Raven was still on stage, and you're trying to kind of get cute with it. So, got to reel yourself back in on that one. But Raven King not letting him get a chance to collect himself. Already attacking on 52%. Yeah, zero to 50 in a hot minute. And looking for a down tilt to up smash, but the platform was just a little bit away, and it kind of messed up the angle, I suppose? I'm not sure what happened there, but it's, it's going to be tricky for Ice Knight to find the stock now from that, that back foot. Look at how little he's been landing these down tilts in this set. Has not gotten a single down tilt up smash so far. And Arsene is going to be coming back out, and oh! That's huge. That was so clutch, turning the shuriken around and allowing him to turn his back air to the back side on the low recovery. That's going to keep Ice Knight in this game, but let's see what Raven King's got. A forward throw into downward guns, attempting some kind of lead trap, but the slippery frog is out of there. Yeah, he's going to need a dash attack or some kind of combo opener to try to bring this back. Gets the down throw into back air, but not too much to it, and he's off stage. Getting the back air, not quite doing it. Yeah, what well, great coverage from Raven King, and he's continuing his downward angle guns. Down there, turns Whoa. around, and that is enough to get the job done. I I've never seen it. that before. Like, the, the move definitely has a solid amount of knockback, but 170 on stage? Uh, Greninja's not light. Not, he, yeah, he's about midway. He's um, about midway. And that's the, he's been hunting for those down airs off the ledge the entire set. So like, one of those is gonna land and it sure did. Sealing out that game three. Raven King sitting pretty right now. And so here we go into game number four. It will, uh, I, I predict that this will then be Joker Greninja for the rest of the set, even though it goes to game five. I won't be surprised if this goes to the game five with how Raven King's playing right now. Not that, obviously, Ice Knight, incredible player, certainly capable, but like, Raven King just has a beat on what he, what decisions he needs to do, where he needs to commit, and Ice Knight just having a hard time opening him up. And that's one of the things I appreciate about Raven King's style of play when specifically pivoting to the Joker is so many, like, solo mains commit to that style so hard. But Raven King committed Ooh. incredibly to the Joker, and look at him get paid off for that forward smash. That, that's on one of those right down low complete forward smashes. Oh, I thought he was done. Yeah, that's not what you want to go out. Ice Knight's still fighting here, but Arsene is coming out. You do not mind this Arsene at all. Look at you get you get an air going, and you have zero to forty oh, in a second. No. Hello? Uh oh. Ooh, the Hydro oh. Pump saving his life there. How did Hydro Pump get a forward hitbox in time to save Greninja? That's incredible, but it doesn't matter. Like, zero to 90 anyway. Yeah, this this is a hole and a half to climb out of for Ice Knight. Will Raven King keep that stranglehold, but no, get, gets hit by the forward air. Ice Knight can still do this. Yeah, the, the patient forward airs will eventually get the job here for done for night side. But what a drag down to F Smash! Raven King has the killer instinct. He is going to winners finals and he has anything he can say about it. Yeah. I feel like that's really those forward airs I feel like have really been what Ice Knight's been missing in this set. He, his shield pressure hasn't really been there with the nares, the forward airs. And but here we go, starting to see those aerials come out and it's if he can survive this Arsene, things are looking great for Ice Knight. 
dead even just like that. What a stock. That is exactly what Ice Knight needed. We were talking about how Raven King just owned this game. But all of a sudden, Ice Knight brings it to parity here on Pokemon Stadium. But, I mean, this is a good run here for Raven King, 0-52. Yeah, this this last stock could, if, if Ice Knight can put this to a game five, that's when it gets tough for Raven King, because now you're the one that's got the pressure on you. Right. But not deterred right now, getting a lot of damage. What a great down here under the Pokemon Stadium platform. Just catch that tricky angle. Lost yeah. spot dodges back and forth here on Stadium, but the Dash Jack catches again. Getting the forward air, dash attack. But Arsene, you gotta make sure you get the right hit when this before this Arsene comes out. But may not get the opportunity, because Arsene does still come out with time. And there he is. Back throw. This is tough. Yeah, how do you get out of this back and you situation? Don't. There was nowhere to go on the Pokemon Stadium platform, and Raven King moves on to winner's finals at ignition number 300. He is absolutely cooking today. Really? I, using I the blame most the t-shirt. Oh, I feel like that'd be the opposite of cooking, so you'd be sleeping with that Snorlax shirt on. Sometimes you fall asleep with the oven on. True. And, you and, it, and it's tough. Let him cook. <laughs> Let him cook. And he sure is cooking all the way to that winner's finals. With $300 pot, 300 entrance, you're making good money today. Yeah, Raven King is like guaranteed, I don't know. Um, I was also saying that.